Guess who's back? Back again. Mikey's back. Tell a friend. Hey, everybody here with another video for you guys today. And today, we're going to be looking at the classic Lego set of Flame Chaser, set number 6531. We're going to be building it and reviewing it. Um, but before I go any further, let me just say, if you like this video, any of the videos on the channel, please like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll be getting into the Lego Flame Chaser vintage set after my intro coming in now. Nah. Um, my good buddy, let's see if we can get the CT Jason, who is one of my co hosts on the Iron show with me. Um, he sent us this classic Lego police or fire helicopter. You put it on the big screen. Okay, Look at that thing. Still sealed in plastic and Still everything. Still sealed in plastic. Um, we were debating whether to open it or not, but he very much wants us to open it. 53 pieces. Interlocking pieces. Like that. <laughs> That's how they used to say it. Uh, set number 6531. What is that? I know. I feel so bad opening it. He wants us to do it. Okay. So let's do it. How fast can Jen open 53 pages or build 53, 53 pieces? Piece set. I can't even open the plastic. It's criminal. There ought to be a law. Of me? Yeah. Opening the plastic. Opening a set that's this old. Oh, no. There's a plastic underneath it. There's, There's like plastic two. underneath the plastic. That's like six plastics. <laughs> that was funny. That makes me think that like Hugh says it takes me back to my childhood. It's an old one. Yeah. I know. Yeah. There's something, I don't There's something kind of magical about these classic Lego ones, in my opinion. Oh, uh, there it goes. Oh. There you go. I'm such a Bax lover. Oh my gosh. Try but uh, in the box. CT, if you see this, thanks again, thanks my so friend. Much. That was very cool of you. We're excited. Yeah. I feel bad I'm this box. Well, we'll put the box on the wall nicely. Yeah. See what kind of set number is 6531. Oh, there's a brick that wasn't in a bag. Oh, one the, random one, one plate. Random long plate. And then there's this little insert here. Old Free Lego mini set. Old Join a world of fun in the Lego Builders Club. Hey, kids, are you a Lego maniac? Join the Lego Builders Club. Free Lego mini set see details inside there's like a little thing you can send off to join the fun that's, that's literally me cool. on the picture there that's literally you yeah there's little mikey <laughs> are you a lego maniac kid yes i had yes, a little I spiky was. hair as well become part of the fun Ollendorf said it worth over fifteen hundred according to price checker. Rare Lego if unopened. Oh, you opened it. It worth five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ollendorf. This is pretty cool though. Yeah. And then here's the instructions. Oh, I see the monorail in there. Oh, this is like a 
another advertisement inside there. It's not part of the instructions. It's got the town, the whole town. This um, is neat. I like this. That's a nice picture. And then it's got Black Knight's Castle, yep. Ooh, the Imperial flagship, the original one, and and there's a Imperial this, Trading Post. Yeah, and then the space. Yeah. And then what's this one? Looks like the trains. Oh man, the trains have come a long way. Yeah. Oh my that. gosh. Yeah, and then the a Rock Island Refuge is on there. Yeah, look at the train. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the poor little design train. If David Warner was here, ah, or Gordon, Gordon Warner, Warner was here, you would have a field day on that train. I like this. This is cool. Yeah. All right, let's see if I can get it built. Now, here, here's a here's a little interesting tidbit I'll discuss with you guys while she's building this. Um, He's got the hole in his head. Oh, yes. I don't know how well he oh, can... and look at these are the rough. He's yeah. got the hole in his head. And these are the rough. Um, I don't know if you can see it. See how rough it is instead of smooth. Yeah. For the wedges, see how it is. See how it's rough. Mm -hmm. And they're mostly they're usually smooth. But that that dates the minifigure, at least the head, to a certain time when they have the hole in the head like that because. You know, Lego doesn't no longer does that. Um, but there were some heads that predate those. Do you know why they did that? They said it was for choking reasons. That's what, what I heard. Was too. the original reason. Now that I don't know how accurate that is. That could just be a urban legend kind of a thing. Right. But that was what they said. Now, here is the head pieces that predate the hole in the head ones. Shows up. It's a stud. It's just a, a a stud, but it's not indented, and it says Lego right on top. So it's like a it's like a, a one stud. Yeah, it's like a it's like yeah, it's like it's just a regular stud. Some of my forestman guys have that head. Yeah. Yeah. See, the heads now they're 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 indented, but they're not hollow. Yeah, I have four extra. Well, they give me these two as well. But I've got four extra pieces and I don't know where they go. And they're not in the instructions. So this is like a mystery box. <laughs> this fl flame chaser. It's not. Yeah, I don't see them in here either. Mm -mm. It's like they've got the parts for this one, but the instructions for another one. Because they changed this right here because you can take these little that's what they want me to do they want me to take these out and put these there with this on the side but it's super cool i love the well that's cool thank you so much ct i really do like this little helicopter and i'm glad we opened it because yeah. it's pretty cool even though we got extra pieces we can have extra pieces yeah. Nobody ever said, you know what? Maybe I should put. Does it have? Well, it doesn't, but I'm going to put them on there anyway. Yeah, might as well. Yeah, it looks like the police. It's a fire. I mean, you could put these little pieces in there and make it look like it's a chair for him in there, but no. then he'll just fall out. Yeah. It'd be better to sit his butt in the studs. Yeah. Oh, the top doesn't open so well either with the, with the things. But yeah, I like it a lot. I always love a helicopter. <laughs> checking my work? I am checking. Seeing yeah. if I was doing it wrong. Yeah. I know exactly where they go. In the build on the box. In the build on the box, you can see this is an L piece, and then there's a one stud here, and that's what I have left over. But they included in... The instructions, they included the slope pieces there instead in the instructions. There's no, what are you doing with that? 
Just showing them off a little bit. Uh -huh. There's no spot for these in the instructions. Mm. That, those ones, that little else. Yeah. So that's funny that it's misprinted or they, they changed the design. It's almost like they changed the design before they printed the um, instructions, but not before they printed the box art. Hugh <laughs> just said it was $80 buy it now with $22 postage from the Netherlands for this set. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> wow. But again, it was a gift. It was now, a priceless gift from a friend of ours, and he wanted us to open it. If so. if I had been if I had come across it from a stranger or something, then yeah, I would have been thinking about putting it in our Bricklink store. Yeah, I would have. But it's more nostalgic. Yeah, for the flame chaser. Yeah. So cute. There he is. That's all more like the Jetsons, but. Mm. He's pretty cool though. I'm excited to have him in our in our on our fire station. Oh, <laughs> I was trying to spin his little thing. Woo! I like him a lot. I do too. Hey, thanks for watching. And don't forget, we got merch store. If you want to take a little piece of the show with you, you can get it right here. We got everything. You want some Mikey J stuff? We got the Mikey J Productions for you. So take a chance and stop by. We'll take care of you.